Hey guys, so it has been a little while since my last sketchbook update, so this is a pretty big one, but uh, we're going to try and go through these pretty quick because there's a lot of them. So I'm using a new pencil for these sketches. This is a Rot Wing, 2, Rot Ring Rapid Pro 2.0. Elena is going to be going through this with me too. So, But uh, I'll do a full review of these pencils. My wife got them for me for Christmas. I have... Um, a new black one as well uh, and they are pretty awesome so my next video will be a review of these and I, I am really enjoying these so cause as you'll see later in the sketchbook update you can change the color of the lead in them so here we go so you guys some of you have seen some of these but these are fairy drawings that I've been working on and this one's Elena's favorite isn't it mm -hmm. yep so these fairies are kind of just different ideas uh, that come together different types of fairies um, and this one was supposed to be kind of like a darker but more sophisticated kind of divine fairy uh, and I'm really just kind of experimenting right now but this is these ideas are for kind of a bigger project Daddy, yeah I like her eyes you like her eyes how come because they're beautiful and they're, like they're kind of weird huh because they're white in the center so that's the first one Last one. Mm, this one's scary. This one's kind of like the eyes I got from a spider. The clothing is made out of moss. Kind of an interesting little fairy. That kind of trying different things, different shapes on the wings. Where's this fairy from, Bug? Um, from a bakery. Yep, it's a bakery fairy. So it's kind of the hat inspired by dough, but having fruits and stuff like that too. Uh, with little feather dress. Another interesting idea. This is like a warrior fairy, huh? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Do you like this one? Mm -hmm. She's pretty. What do you like about her? Her um, her arms going up like that. Yeah, she's flying. So, but still, the wings are always kind of the same in these. And I try something a little different on this one. And this is a rat fairy inspired by a rat. Look at those wings. They're like more insect-like, which I think I like these wings better. So at this stage, I'm just kind of exploring different types of like how to draw these. Her eyes are kind of scary, huh? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And these were some sketches that I was working on. Really rough. So here's a sketch that didn't work out, so I didn't carry it on, but I was looking, thinking about an idea for like a frog fairy. And I ended up with this one, which I liked a lot better. Uh, this is kind of like a tree frog fairy, so she'd be really brightly colored. But uh, I just like the natural way this one's done. I referenced a lot of stuff in this one, so much better uh, result for this one. So here is using some, let me pop the lead out here real quick. So I have these, this, these kind of come with these pencils. Let me get the red out. Oh, where's that? So here you can see some of the reds that kind of go with this. And basically this lead just pops out like this and you just throw a red one in there. And so uh, I was sketching with red and then I used some graphite for the eyes. What do you think of that one, Buck? Good. You like it? What do you like about it? Is she pretty? Mm -hmm. She has short hair though, huh? Mm -hmm. But I kind of think that's neat to do sometimes, don't you? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Because some girls do and some Girls don't. Yep, but they're all beautiful, huh? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Okay, so let's go to the next drawing. This is kind of just an ink quick sketch. I was messing around on this page. That one's kind of weird, huh? Um, that was my picture. Oh, yeah, you drew a drawing on my sketchbook, weren't you? Uh -huh. That's good. And here's another ink, but with some of that, some blue, which I have right here. That's more of those leads I kind of just throw in there to experiment with. Um, I love you. So here, she's pretty, huh? Do mm -hmm. you like her eyes? Uh huh. What They're would you perfect. do on this one? Um, make her hair blonde. You make her hair blonde. That would look pretty good. Uh huh. But yeah, I mean, the reason I like these pencils is they work just like lead. Um, but you can just have a little bit of color if you want. So here is another fairy. Another one, again, looking at a different approach to the wings, kind of mixing a little bit of the insect with that first style I did. But this fairy, I remember, was a memory fairy, so she steals memories. Uh -huh. That's, she, would she climb in through your ear and take them out while you're sleeping? 
<laughs> so what do you think that's a memory of? Um, of thinking of what dinosaurs names are. Oh, so the person who she stole that memory from can't remember dinosaurs names anymore, huh? That's terrible. She's bad. She's a bad dad fairy. Yeah. So here's another sketch with, let's get a little closer on this one. That's with the blue and some white highlights. Kind of just a weird alien thing. I don't like her. You don't like her? How come? Because it's kind of like a duck bill for that left ear, doesn't it? Okay, what fairy is this one, Bug? This is um a lava fairy. Do you like this one? Uh-huh. I like her wings and her hair. You like her wings and her hair? It's on fire, isn't it? It's like white fire, but it would be red if I colored it in, huh? But she's made out of rock, so this was another, I wanted to do a completely different <laughs> fairy. <laughs> and I know, I'm silly. And so this one's, she's made out of rock and lava and fire and stuff like that. So very different than my other ones. So here is the other half of the fairy ideas was goblins. So this was my first kind of goblin concept. He's kind of funny, isn't he? Mm -hmm. Do you think he's friendly or mean? Mean. Why? Because he's, he looks like um, a, between um, um, a goblin and a, a space creature. Oh, yeah. I thought he looked like Nicolas Cage. I think he's a Nicolas Cage goblin. That's what I wrote on my Instagram post when I posted this. Because I feel like for some reason he looks like Nicolas Cage to me. So. Oh, here's a bigger one. This one's cool. So I spent a little bit more time on this one, you guys. So, zoom in a little bit. So this one is kind of like a, a warrior guy. He just got done fighting a bunch of dudes and beating the crap out of them. But this is a drawing where I spent more time just doing a whole page, filling in every little piece of it. Uh, I like the way this one turned out. It was a fun yeah, drawing to do. that's a bad word. What is? Um. Crap. Mm-hmm. Okay, I won't say that. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Do you like this one? Mm-hmm. So what happened here? Um, he invited, a, um, Dad. Yeah. I wanted you to put a little rock on that guy. A rock on him? How come? Because it looks like he smashed on the tree. Oh, the rock? Yeah. So anyway, that one was pretty cool. I like the way it turned out. Is that one scary? Uh-huh. It looks like This was mean. just kind of a quick sketch. He looks just... like he's mean. He looks like he's mean? Mm -hmm, but he's nice. Oh, he is? But he just looks mean. Because mm -hmm. sometimes people who look mean are actually really nice. And you shouldn't just judge people by the way they look, huh? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I want to meet that guy because he's nice. Oh, good. I'm glad. Well, you still need to be careful, though. Remember, stranger danger, right? Stranger danger? Mm -hmm. You don't talk to strangers, huh? Mm -mm -mm -mm. Okay, here's another sketch. Wow, this is... I did a lot of sketches. So this was kind of just a quick sketch. Space guy, mm -hmm. space helmet. Interesting little drawing. I feel like with these pencils, you can get really sharp with them, but I do love the weight of these so this is a good example of I'm a little bit looser but I still have my kind of tightness there a little bit so like again I'll do a review of these later probably in the next week or so <laughs> robot girl she's got half a robot face so I used uh, the red on this one with some graphite kind of a fun she's interesting looking the proportions on her face are weird but I think that just adds to her I don't know androgynous somebody said she looked like uh, David Bowie. So, ooh, scary guy. Is he nice too? I think he's just mean. He looks mean to me. Yep, he does. Yeah, again, pretty loose with the red and stuff like that. But really, really guy. liking the weight. Of I the won't meet that guy. I won't. Okay. Um, oh, what about her? Are you gonna um, meet her? Uh huh. She's pretty. This is just a profile picture. Got. Uh, tired of doing straight on shots so I decided to do a little profile oh here's an alien monster what do you think he looks like an alien um, between a goblin monster uh, maybe a squid face guy huh yeah yep just kind of a concept for a weird alien thing and a lot of these I was just messing around with the pencils figuring stuff out kind of doing different things so Ooh, ballerina. I like that one. She pretty, huh? Mm-hmm. Yeah. 
Make sure she's in a dress. Yes, you, I knew you'd like this one. She is very pretty. Ooh, quick sketch of a, another scary like monster. You don't, I don't like that. Okay, let's turn it real quick. Oh, that's scary, huh? Okay, and this is a weird little guy, isn't he? Yeah, he, looks like, like, a, he looks like a water, a water monster. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. Mm. I think he's kind of like an insect robot man. He looks like a water insect man that lives in the water. Okay, that makes sense, Bug. Okay, here's one. I'm gonna post this one on Instagram so you guys are gonna see it before that, but it's kind of a just doodling one day and wanted to come up with something odd. So, this one. I like this one. And it's not done yet, but yeah, I like it too. It's kind of, she's kind of weird looking, huh? She has one big robot eye, doesn't she? Mm -hmm. But just kind of interesting, creative, fun stuff. Uh, this is my newest one, and I really like this one. It's very natural, uh, gestural, well, I don't know. the rocks are and stuff but I like that contrast between how loose this stuff is and then the you know how dark she is so the value there is nice this is just a nice drawing um, as far as its appearance from the drawing technique goes which sometimes the subject matter is really nice and then sometimes I like stuff because of the drawing technique and this is I feel like a strong drawing technique type drawing so anyway I think that's it for sketches yes it is so what do you think of Daddy's sketches this time around? Good. Good? What one was your favorite? Um, let's go. That guy. Um, That's your favorite, isn't it? Nope. Nope? That guy? Oh, that one? Mm -hmm. Was it this one or was it one of the fairies? It was one of the fairies. Go to the beginning. Oh, the beginning? How yeah. That one. You like that one, don't you? Uh -huh. Why do you like this one so much? Because he has, um, Pointy, um, pointy wings, and her she has horns. Yeah, and a little. Those a are kind spot of spot on her face. Well, maybe I'll give you this so I can hang this one up in your room or something. Okay. Mm -hmm. So anyway, guys. It looks like a fairy. It looks like a fairy. Um, it looks like a bird fairy. Oh. So that's the video guys, um, like I said, I'll be doing a review video this week sometime of these pencils, which I love, and a few other things I got, but mainly just a review of these uh, mechanical 2.0 pencils. They're just straight up lead. You have like a, a teeny little sharpener that you sharpen the lead with. So if you're curious about those, look for that video coming up real quick. Uh, thanks for watching. If you like the video, I've got tons of these sketchbook update, update videos, including one that I just recently posted with three years of these. If you want to catch up to my channel, check that one out. Thanks for watching, and should they subscribe? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, so subscribe, like the video, and share it if you want to. Uh, thanks again. Bye. Bye. <laughs> do, do, do. Huh? Good job, sweetie. You did awesome. Yeah.